another chapter. Let's go. The one escape room I've been to my, in my life did have a poker table at it. So what is the deal? The button must be missing something. Electricity? There's cards of which we can move. Well, I can't actually do much, but there's a temple ship card, null, death, home science, stars. Let's read this in the meantime. Miss Margaret Cox, I am writing to you for the final time. Before I begin the proceedings, I brought to your attention. Since my brother's disappearance, you have attached yourself to my mother like a leech. You ha or For her sake, I would prefer this to be quiet, but you are a charlatan and a fraud, and I will expose you at such as I must. Leave her be or else the paper has offered me a full page. Robert Bailey, a viewfinder. Can I do anything with this? Rotate some of this stuff, expand on it as per a telescope. So let's see what else I can work with. There's actually a lot going on here. Let's check out the camera. Probably makes sense that a viewfinder goes on the camera. Don't actually know where a viewfinder goes on the camera. Hopefully here. Hopefully here. There we go. Very cool. A small metal handle. Probably also goes on here, right? Because this is supposed to be hand wound. Okay. So now do I look through it? Yeah, yeah, through the viewfinder, of course. I see. We have found the view. Nice. A little letter on the floor I'll look at first. For Simon Grayson, aka the Great Khan, what has become of you? You know I can tell when you're lying. I was the only one you could never fool. I know you have it. Have you started playing without me? It sounds magnificent. This pressman isn't going to leave me alone, and you owe me you so. Since when can you resist putting on a performance? We'll be pioneers. I'll be at the lion at 9 o'clock. You'll be there. I know you, Mags. V, aka 5. Can't really do much with that, but that's, uh, that's good. I'm glad we saw this. I don't know what this is for, but I bet we'll have to come back to this at some point. Anyways, let's look at the table. Check out down here. This rotates up. What are these? What are those? Switches. Okay, I do not have the code. And I'm not going to brute force this. How about this? So we need to find another one of these. Anything? Here. I can slide these. I Okay, that's four. It's counting down. Who knows what to? How about this? So this is a key. Keyhole. We do not have the type of key for it. How about this thing? Oh god, Ouija board? Seems like there's a part missing for the typewriter. You're joking. So what, we're gonna have to type a message? I don't have any parts right now. How about over here? Infinity. Here's the two. So I found five, four, and two. Where's the three and one? Also, is there anything helpful here? Not currently helpful, maybe this? Another strange lock it seems i need how about up here oh the one two three four five these drawers are locked so it only counts to five what else have i not or looked at here what about up here this is new to me oh shit oh i found a key small key can i move some of these yeah i can okay so key stuff let's go over here first well, long one's going here, short one's going here. This one's going here. Was it like this? I forget. Yeah, it was like that. Okay. Cool key. Right oh. A lot going on here. Who knows? What can I interact with? I can move this around. Um, oh, so this is one of those puzzles. Well then, I will gladly shift these about. We're playing rush hour now. Okay, so I released half of it. The other half must also be released. And there it is. A metal symbol is at the front of here. And we have unlocked a long metal lever, probably for the typewriter. Can't say where, so I'm just gonna jam it on the typewriter. Probably here. Ah! Anyways, let's unlock this door. I don't have an idea for a message. Well, actually I do have an idea for a message. Infinity. Let's type out infinity, as tedious as that may be. Ah, uh, for infinity. New line.
Well. <laughs> well. <laughs> Lovely. Staring at the stars. So much to discover, so little time. I love how the ah is still there. Okay, so we still want to, want to unlock this. Because that's something else we could do. Doesn't seem too bad. The jagged one goes to the right. The small one, uh, the big one was down. Was that it? Yeah, that was it. What's inside? A puzzle box. What is even going on? I can't grab this or like pull it out. Am I not capable of yoinking it out so I can work with this? But it looks like there needs to be something that goes here that I can slide about. So I need like a little, I don't know, like just a little circular thing. Is there anything else this key can unlock? Yeah, like here. Oh boy. What's in the drawer? Nothing. Okay, what's in the second drawer? Nothing. Okay, so I think actually we're supposed to have the drawers go at the lengths of some of these numerals. So I've seen a five, a four, and a two. So what if I just have it at five, four, two and hope that's the right? Yeah. Okay. A light bulb. I saw the light bulb in the light up there. And now this comes out. Alright, so let's do puzzles. Can I? Oh, I can move these. Okay, yeah. I'm like, hello. Okay, so let's take this back. Oh, there's a lot of options. Let's just follow the lines and see what happens. Yep, there we go. Nice. Cosmos, the Star's Tarot card. Well, well, well. Let's attach it. Stars. Didn't do shit. Button must be missing something. Well, we have a light bulb. A light bulb for this thing kind of makes sense. Yeah, actually, especially it's missing one. Okay, so now I need to turn it on. There we go. Taking a picture straight up. What's it going to reveal that I couldn't see before? Ghosts. Jesus. Well, it's okay. We, we're familiar with boxes. That makes it a lot less spooky. That's all right. The, uh, the spookiness is offset by the fact that it's a box. We can't actually... Wait. Now, the button... It's a shuffler, maybe? Can I... Oh, I can take these cards, put them on here. Well, I'm going to put three random ones and see if it does anything. But I have a feeling we need a specific three cards. Yeah, we need a specific three cards. So I will try to figure out that from other areas. Well, let's, what's at the top here? Waiter. I do not know the order in which we put the cards. Waiter. I'm tempted to take a hint here. Due to inability to interact with stuff currently oh but i haven't been here i'm very glad i didn't so there's a torn photo what about this area that's something i can't unlock is there anything else i can zoom in on since i'm in or you know checking out the room itself so i gotta find out somewhere that gives me lets me know what three cards home stars time there we are Thank you, ghosts. Nice. Voyage. Maybe I'm supposed to type voyage on the typewriter. That's my thought. E, voyage. Cool. Ship's Temple Home. Ship Temple Home. Round two. What spooky word can we get this time? Jesus. They have been awakened. They are among us. Endless. Endless. Under these... Alien stars. Okay, stars. Death? Was death one? Stars, death. Oh, piss off. They're out of ink. No, no. What is that? Stars, death, science? And then a blank line. Well, 
That's not good. Oh, we don't have death. We do have science, so we need to find the death. Uh, I am tempted to take the hint just because it feels like I've searched everything. I think I'll take the hint. You can't see the letters. What, so I need more ink? Well, I'm dumb. There's this. Up, up, down, up, down, down, up. <laughs> yeah, how to forget about this. It's been so long since I've had to use this. Up, up, down, up, down, 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 up. Wow, yeah, I forgot about that. It's the death card. I'll just place it on here first. Stars, death, science. When are we getting those null cards, huh? The room is angry! The bell fell off. Hope. I can even take the bell. Oh, the null card. We have no idea where that is. Null, time, death. Okay, so a bell. A small bell. Oh, a puzzle bell. The clapper from a bell. Okay, <laughs> you can do stuff with this as well. Is this a key? Clapping cheeks? Oh, fuck, where have I seen this before? It seems like a key. Is it on the box? Is it on here? <gasps> Is it for the cabinet, if not this? It's probably not true for both this and the cabinet. Yeah, it's returnable, so we'll get it back. A brass dial. Was this the thing for the cabinet? I thought it was. It looks like it. Yeah! One key, two holes. Open nice and wide. I can't open the other one for some reason. This is a rotational puzzle. Still don't think I'm great at these, but I mean, we can just play it. So we can slow roll it. Something's not right here. I'm not that bad at these. But this looks almost like something. Because it looks like this is a house. The tree covering the house makes sense, but I don't know what this wavy stuff is that's like in front of the bottom floor of the house. That's the weird part to me. Maybe, maybe it's just odd. What about this up here? I can interact with that. Oh, well, here's the inner. Innerd. Please, open. Stay open. Hey, you want to, like, stay open? Okay, that works, too. Cool. Con. All right, well, maybe ignoring that, let's check out this book. Oh, shit. What is going on? Looks like a place for this. Oh, con. Oh, what the fuck? This is weird. So I gotta do this and then go the other way. Okay. Con. All right. It's the null card. Ladies and gentlemen, we found it. Time for more spooky times. Okay. What do we got? The complete and utter collapse of everything. Oh boy. Shattered glass. We still have not fixed the picture, but I guess it's probably going to stay torn. Wait, that's it? Maybe I... Oh, well, the thing got shut. I need keys now. I, don't, I didn't get my cards back. What kind of ripoff is that? There's stuff that flew off the wall. This is all taken care of. What about this? <gasps> Here's the rest of the picture. And this. If you are here, then my travels have not been in vain. If nothing else, my promise to you gave me purpose. If I was damned for trapping you here, then now I offer you my redemption. Finally, I hold the key. To the secret to this world of worlds, this place of endless places. With you, it may lift the veil, peek behind the curtain. We do not have to take the path that is offered. All right, let's fill in the picture. Spooky. RIP! Oh, that is actually spooky. Good God. Motherfucker. What happened to you? Now you see the truth of it. Time within this place works differently from without. An hour, a day, a century, who is to say? A pity. I had to wait here to see you on your final step of the journey. Everything is in readiness. Take this, use it to find the room. Roll credits.
Obviously, I must inspect you. He has something in the palm of his hand. Oh, it's a watch. There was something about 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock. That doesn't matter. There's a key inside of his watch. What in the fuck? Thank you. This is back. What is going on? Chapter complete. You are to be congratulated. You escaped with the curious events of the seance with all your faculties intact. Let's do this. Continue game. Should be a brand new chapter. Yeah, brand new. This is entirely new to me. So we're on a little dinghy. Cool looking area though. Kind of dark. There we go. It's probably a lot better. All right. So let's see. What can I interact with? Let's let's see what all can be interacted with so I get a general idea and so I don't have to let the game just walk me everywhere. Actually, there's not much. I could zoom into there, but nothing further. Spooky. We found a crank handle. Probably for that area we just zoomed into. AKA right here. Let's crank and bring ourselves in to the spooky island. Oh, we're actually moving. What is this place? Why are we going? I don't trust this. I didn't agree to going into this. Oh, we completed the chapter. <laughs> <laughs> Even short journeys can cover great distance, and by making it to the other side of the crossing, you are now ready for the final step. May good fortune go with you. Damn, that was a tough chapter. Hopefully this one's easier. First thing that catches my eye is this box on the table. So I'm actually going to put on the eyepiece, because I think having the eyepiece on the box could be quite helpful. What's this? Looks like something could fit in here. Okay, we'll have to find something. Looks like a key or a lock for a key. Looks like a preserved beetle. I can't click on the top. What about this? Eyepiece isn't really doing much for me right now. What about this thing? Oh, is that not something I can click on? How about this? So the table itself has things you could fit in. Anywhere to get me started. I see nothing. And I also had not seen anything while circling the table. So that's very fine. Whoa. Okay, I guess we're over here now. That's totally okay too. Maybe we can turn this. Well, we can turn it a little bit. Not very far, though. Eventually, I'll find what to do. I think with a room this big, it's very important to just explore as much as possible. This is an actual room, how? Yeah, it's pretty weird. So, what do we think this material is? Oh, boy. This looks like something that we'll have to maybe work with eventually. Oh, they're numbers. So, there's one through zero and the triangle. So, obviously, we need to find a code somewhere. Well, we'll keep looking about. How about this? Absolutely nothing gained from that. How about in here? Okay, is it a microscope? Here's a one. How many? There's a two here. Anyways, I want to find this thing. I don't recognize it. It could be th No, it's not this. Could be this thing. Oh, well, the one is visible here, too. Let's open it, I suppose. Screwdriver. Radis, radis. Subject necrosis significantly halted by post-mortem app of serum 5. Temporary musculature reflex restoration witnessed uh, with post-mortem electrical stimulation of range uh, 75 to 85, what, milliamps? Interesting. A star state in indentation and part of the plaque is missing. Interesting. Let's go check out the two. Wait, there's a one up here as well. Let me look at the screwdriver itself. Flathead. Can anything be moved on it? No, it looks very ordinary. Nothing special about it. Nothing moves or drags. So I'm looking for flatheads. These are circles, so I'm not even going to try putting the screwdriver in there. What's this thing? It's a book. I cannot open the book. And for the other area we have not explored, this, which there is so much. All I want is something that the screwdriver can open. I hope we'll f stumble on that eventually. So it's subject Alpha 17. Lamprina orata. The subject is unresponsive. The post-mortem app of application of serum 4 combined with electrical stimulation of range 10 to 100 milliamps. 
Uh, corpus de degradation is considerable with high amps. Conclude Coloptra unsuitable for further study. I thought this said Cleopatra for a second. What is a Coloptra? Anyway, so another one of these things. So what? This this lets you see basically other things in depth. So it, it feels useless. All right, well let's keep looking around. Well let's let's explore this. I'm I'm looking for a flathead, but still exploring. I still have not even looked at everything yet. That's crazy. This room is so involved. All right, so this moves probably to power some device. I assume I need other things before I can power said device. A recess with electrical connections inside. Yeah, so we're probably gonna have to connect those ourselves, maybe? Um, this almost reminds me of the null element. Hey, look, a flathead. Nice. A wooden box. All right, what's in the fucking box? box? Numbers. So we need to find those symbols and the numbers by it. Uh, I mean, we did see numbers before. Maybe 669 is important or it's just random. I might check out the numbers again though. Cause I mean, that's the only other thing with numbers. Let's check this out. So, oh, these do match up with numbers. These symbols and numbers. Okay, so what were the symbols I'm looking for? The two wavy lines, so that's a one. Next is the S with the line through it. That's a seven. And then what is this symbol? Three. What's in the box? A battery. Probably to power that battery sized hole. Can I examine the battery first things first? I assume we will, like here's where I think it's gonna go. Actually, well, it could go here. This is a battery sized hole. But I swear there was another battery sized hole as well. Whatever, we got this moving. <gasps> Electricity! All right, it's green now, so now we have power, or maybe we just charge the battery. We have a charged battery now, that's what I figure. So now we put the charge battery in the other battery size hole. So here is the other battery sized hole I was thinking about. So let's see what this does. Probably this, locks in, and it's on. This rotate, oh, okay, so that bounces. Maybe I should be looking in here now? And I can aim, oh, like this. And now we're hitting the box. Oh, and that's just straight up open something. Oh my god, we're reflecting stuff. That's fun. And the star-shaped handle. I know there was a star-shaped handle. I might have to, I forget where, though. It might have been one of the cabinets from here, I believe. But I'll go back to the beam eventually. I think I can deal with the handle right now. The handle. The handle. There we go. Okay, so I like this room a lot right now. Two. So is there a, more stuff in here? There's something on the side. Let's access what's inside first. A drum of images. Dear Professor De... While I doubt your altruistic motives, your sister's condition is not aided by her continued confinement to your estate. I beg of you to see Madame Lucy return to the sanatorium as early as can be arranged. Yours, Dr. Beckett. So what's this thing? Two moves. So now we want the one to move. So what? It was the side of the two. Can I make this go back to one? Oh, probably, yeah, with this, right? So there's probably something on the side of one. Maybe on the other side, possibly? Would you look at that? Nice. Two is the two, one is the one. Let's open this, check out some... I said, let's open this. I said, let's open this. Damn, this game is hard. Can I access these beetles? No. Okay, I can I can access them now. So I'm... There's a bug missing. If the label's correct, it should be a stag beetle. So there was a beetle, like, preserved in something that I probably should be adding here eventually. I don't think I can access that yet. What about this thing up top? Subject, subject EH. Upper right appendage severed at gleno humoral joint necrosis and subject halted completely via pre-mort application of serum 5 followed by post-mortem application of serum 4 perfect musculature reflex witness with electrical stimulation at 77 at and three quarters milliamps what's this do a large handle that could be for anything what does the handle even look like 
a square. I swear I've seen a square hole, but I've seen so much, so I'm, I'm gonna have to backtrack. I swear it was over here, but maybe I'm misremembering. Square hole. Well, this goes here, doesn't it? This should go here. Another battery spot. Anyways, square hole. Was it on this box? I'm, I'm trying to remember. Maybe it was on the side. No, this was circular. Wait, but there's a square on the inside of the circle, isn't there? Okay. And this rotates. So this moves this thing left and right. I don't yet know what this thing is, but maybe it does something all the way over here. Whoa. Wait, now I can move this. Hold on. Let's have it, the, the beam hit it. It reflects. Another beam. And that goes to over there. Okay, let's, uh, okay, let's adjust this mirror then. This game is neat. So I'm probably hitting the beetle. And where does that go? This unlocks the right side of the cabinet. To find another battery! Anything else I can interact with in here? Oh, a rhinoceros beetle. They said they wanted a stag beetle. But I'm still going to put the rhinoceros because maybe a rhinoceros beetle is a subset of the stag beetle. I'm still going to try that. Uh, subject L. Cardiac viscous. Necrosis halted indefinitely. Manual operation at 77 and 3 quarter milliamps. Facsimile of life restored only with proximity to raw null. No further avenues. No way back. Dear Huey? Joey? Forgive me. I was too late. So what are they trying to do? Bring bugs back to life? Like Jurassic Park? All right, so the beetle does not attach. Stag beetle, rhinoceros beetle. Rhinoceros beetle goes up there. So anyways, I did want to power the other battery-powered thing. Oh, I need to charge the battery. I forgot about that already. We've done so much. Okay. Uh-oh. We busted it. What happened? Oh, God. A burnt-out fuse. I'll discard it. All right, so what? We need a brand-new fuse. Replace. There's no fixing it. Oh, we just straight up discarded the other one. So we need to find a brand-new fuse. Ah, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to take the hint. What is it? Do any of the jars on the bottom shelf of the cabinet hold anything useful? Bottom shelf of the cabinet. Hey, let's check with the eyepiece. Okay, so this shows up. Oh, I could rotate this. Cool, thank you. I got a broken plaque. Hey, I know where the plaque goes. And, well, okay, that was quick. Uh, a fuse looks like it's intact. I kind of expect this to be a longer journey, but hey, all good. We got our working fuse again. Can we just start rotating again? Okay, looking good. And charging the battery. So let's go see what's on that film. Load this up. This goes in. We should be able to look in here now. I'm going to look at it without the eyepiece, but I'm sure we'll have to look at it with the eyepiece. Oh, that's an arm. All right, so let's put this on. Look in here. Oh, boy. Spooky. Are those symbols? Oh, okay, that's just there. Those symbols? Oh, there's a beetle. A gray... Or a green ground beetle. Yeah, so there's this symbol and then this symbol. So before I work with this though, I'm going to put the beetle on just to see if that does anything. Because I don't know if input... Well, I'd probably get two numbers out of it. Yeah, I'd get, I'd get two numbers. I'm trying to think of anywhere else with numbers. Five. Fifty. Has there been anywhere that's taken in a fifty? I might take a hint. I might take this question mark hint. I think I will. Ah, shit. Not helpful. Tempted to take the other hint, though. It just seems useless. Is there something on the underside? I don't know, because it didn't let me see there. I actually was trying to go to the underside, too, but I couldn't... Oh, fucking never mind. It actually went this time. Water bug. Cool. Small metal handle. It's got this shape on the back. Do I recognize this shape? Nothing speaks out to me. I might take another hint. No, I haven't used one like it recently. Not even once. What does it mean when it says like this? I mean, I've used handles, don't get me wrong, but nothing that has had that shape on the back. Same one used to manipulate the... What? Same one as the metallic liquid? Oh, that's a handle? Oh, gross. 
Okay, well, I see what to do with the 5 0 then. Okay, maybe the. Uh, I should swap them. So this one's 0 and the other one's 5. Oh, it was this one. <laughs> Forgot. Alrighty. Strangely shaped key. Uh, I recognize this key at least. Oh, it's a movable key. Alright, let's do this. Well, it looks like it should be. I guess it just goes to a different hole. Alright, well, I guess we, unless we can move around the, the lock. Oh, we can. Okay, good thing I actually tried that. Stag beetle, please? Stag beetle. And actually, it seems that we are finished with beetles anyways. Another reflector. Okay, so we clearly need to hit that mirror. So which one were we manip- This one. Alright, let's do this. More beam reflecting. So right there. And then to here, what are we potentially- We're probably hitting this. Although, it's probably the plate is going to be in the way, right? That's the idea. Like, we're going to attempt to get to the thing that's on the box, but there's going to be a giant plate just right in the way. Oh, maybe not. Oh, never mind. A lens. Another lens for our eyepiece? Oh my god. A super eyepiece. I will put that on in a second. It seems to be my fate to be forever standing on the shoulders of greater men. My... Montfaucon's work here makes mine appear that of a child, but he never cracked the final secret of the doors as I have. He carried with him the key all along, and he never realized the soul is the root of the null. It comes down to a simple trade, mine for hers and hers for yours. The heart is the seat of the soul. Travel well and don't look back. Whatever you see here, don't ever look back. So, I peace. Ah, yes. More markings. Mathematical formulas. This looks like I have to rotate this. So, okay. I assume this will... Wait, this does rotate. Do these move out at all? Or is the order... Wait, the order is identical, isn't it? So, maybe I'm supposed to touch this? Oh, this has three dots. Okay, now what? Well, we need to find where the two dots go. Um, well, we gotta find more of those symbols. I'm sure they're hidden about. Oh, well, here's one. One dot on the triangles. Damn, the dots themselves blend in so well with the material that they're on. Uh, it's looking for the third one. Do we think it's inside the drawer? <gasps> wait, wait, wait. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. That's tiny. So it's the two triangles. Okay. Oh. Oh boy. It's a heart. Another beam. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Final area. Let's take a look at this thing. What moves? Oh, well. Consume. Interesting. So we need to find one last passcode. The doors change. What about what this I see now? Oh god. I'm actually not sure what I even want to create. This looks like a shape. That looks like a shape. Oh, that's from the first game. Where are we? Oh, God. Monster Zinc is water news. Whoa, we're actually in a non spooky environment for once. For about three seconds.
Rip that house. Congratulations, you have completed the room two, where many have faltered, you have succeeded in discovering the many mysteries held within this most unique space. You fled the laboratory and escaped the confounded house where it all began. After much scientific study, I can only conclude that it is an absolute impossibility that the the null sample under my custody is the only one in existence. It stands to reason that there must be a great number of somehow coordinated samples which exert some form of control over these curious events. From 1903. Fun game. I enjoyed this more than the first one. I'll have to do the room three in a future Variety Friday, I think. Because I have other games I would like to get to today.